Hello, my name is Joshua, and in this video, I'm going to teach you how you can change your navigation bar for your launch cart store. What I have pulled up is I have one of our demo stores pulled up, and you can see that the navigation bar, well, it's lacking. We only have one link, and that link takes the user to our shop page. But what I'm going to do today is I'm going to teach you how to customize your navigation bar and add as many links to as many places as you want. So let's get into it. Okay, so I'm back in the launch cart admin panel and I am at appearance menus. And on this page, we can customize our navigation menu for our theme. Now you can see that here is the current link that I have here. This is my shop page. It's one of our default links. If I click edit on that, I can see that there's the title and it's a menu item that goes to my shop page. Okay, so I can customize this further if I want, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna add some more menu items. So it's as simple as pressing add new and then adding a button title. So for this button, this is gonna be my homepage button and I'm going to link it to our system link homepage. These system links are pages that come with your store already. Um, and dynamic links are links uh, like individual links to certain pages, links to certain categories, links to certain products or custom URLs. But for this, I'm gonna select homepage and I'm gonna press submit. So now we have two links on here, but I wanna do some rearranging, so I'm gonna click and drag right here and move that to the top because I want this one to show first. Okay, now let's say I wanna add a link to one of my custom pages that I've created in my pages section. To do that, I click on add new, and I'm just gonna call this one custom page, and then I'm gonna link it to a dynamic link page and now it's going to ask me to, to select which page I want to link it to. So I'm going to call this one the About Us page. Now I do have the option to open in a new window. What this will do is when a user clicks on this link, instead of it opening it in the same browser tab that, that they're currently in, it will actually open this link outside um, of their current browser tab in a new browser tab. And it's useful really if you're linking somewhere to a site that you don't control. Like if you're linking to an external URL, that's usually recommended practice if you don't want them to leave your site. They can have your site open in one tab and then go to the link in another tab. But for this, I'm gonna leave that unchecked and I'm gonna hit submit. Okay, so we have a home page, a shop page, and a custom page link. And let's just add a few more just to see how easy it is. We'll call this um, category, category shoes. And we're going to change the link to a category. We're going to choose which category we want to go to. I have a shoes uh, section here, and I'm going to hit submit. Okay, let's just add some more while we're here. Let's see, I'm trying to think of, uh, you know what, let's go to a direct product. And you wouldn't name uh, your links these. I'm just using these for your reference. Um, but I am going to link to a product page, and this product page is going to be my t-shirt page. And you know what, I'll call this direct product t-shirt. So we're clear and hit submit. And that's pretty much as easy as it gets. Now you do have more control. You can click on add links and you can see that you can select other custom pages that you've created. You can also link to your contact page and your order lookup page. So for example, maybe I wanted to add a contact link to my navigation bar and I would select contact us. Now I have a contact page in there. So play around with this. You can always delete your links. You can always edit them and rename them whenever you want. And once again, you can always click and drag and rearrange these navigation links. So now that we've customized our menu, let's go ahead and check out our site and see what we changed. Okay, so I'm back on our demo site. Here's the old navigation bar that just used to say shop. I'm gonna refresh this page and we'll see what it says next. Okay, so I've refreshed the page, and now you can see we have a lot more links in our top navigation bar. Home, shop, we have a direct link to a product, we have a direct link to a custom page that we've created, we have a link to a category, and we have a link to our Contact Us page. It's that simple, anybody could do this. I highly suggest you go into your dashboard and customize your navigation links today. I'll see you soon on the next videos.